estimate product of whole numbers. Halloween was approaching. Uncle Josh had sold out of most of his pumpkins, but he still had a few pumpkins that were too big and overripe to be sold as food. How shall I deal with them? Uncle Josh was lost in thought. All of a sudden, he saw the Halloween decorations on the street, and he decided to make the pumpkins into jack-o'-lanterns and sell them. It took Uncle Josh a few days to carve the pumpkins, but they were very welcomed at the weekend fair. Uncle Josh tried to estimate how much he had earned by selling jack-o'-lanterns. He had made 67 jack-o'-lanterns in all, each sold at $38. Can you find the estimation of the product by rounding each factor to the nearest 10? We have discussed rounding, flooring, and ceiling before. Here we do the rounding. For 38, we can pair 8 with 5. Since 8 is greater than 5, we add 1 on the tens place and omit the ones place. Thus, we round 38 to 40 as the nearest 10. For 67, we compare 7 with 5. Since 7 is greater than 5, we add 1 on the tens place and omit the ones place. Thus, we round 67 to 70 as the nearest 10. Now we have a simple calculation. We just need to find the product of 40 times 70. By using the technique of multiplying a whole number by the powers of 10, we get 2,800 as our product. Thus, Uncle Josh earned around $2,800 by selling jack-o'-lanterns. Hey guys, did you find the correct answer?